Julia. Richard. We have arrived in Glastonbury. We have. If you've just joined this and you think, what's this about? I'm the Bald Explorer. This is the lovely Julia. We are doing a series of videos about Glastonbury and I've not been here before. You've been here many, many years ago. Once, briefly. And so we are recording our observations of this mystical place in April and the sun is out more or less there's a bit kind of cloud of. so should we take a stroll and just see what we see and comment I think so okay I'll tell you what I'll do is um, I'll start with the camera facing the other way so there's the sign welcome to Glastonbury with a whole load of interesting places of which we aim to go and investigate uh, over the next two and a half days yeah. I suppose so We've come into Market Square, as far as I can tell. Oh yes, there's a sign up there that says Market Square. And um, immediately there is the, uh, well, it looks like one of those um, Elizabeth, what do they call them? Elizabeth Memorials, but like the Butter Market in the, the marks of Town Square anyway, yeah. um, which is that strange edifice in front of the Crown Hotel. Yeah. Um, now you've been here before, there's so many things to talk about and, and think about. So I saw one tiny piece of it. So it literally. So that's the more I've looked into this, the, that's the, the abbey. less I've realised I knew. And we'll come back in the abbey. Yeah. Oh. So and then there's lots of shops. Now one of the reasons we want to come here because you're interested in your pagan journey. Yeah. Tell us about that as we pass man myth and magic. Well, I've always been interested in um, in, in you know in tribal kind of beliefs. Oh no. Cody. <gasps> tree. Mm. And they're in purple. But, um, yeah. And uh, you know, in my teens I did buy lots of books and read lots of books but I, I never really felt like I was learning anything and just always felt so distant but yeah. Um, so and, and also a little bit, not embarrassed but I was shying away from things that I really liked because I'd always been bullied for the things I liked. So here we go. Look, here's a bookshop talking of books. The Encyclopedia of Witchcraft and Demonology. That doesn't sound the sort of thing that you're interested in. Yours is more white magic, isn't it? The yeah. Magic of, of nature. Yeah. Kabbalah. Uh, Kabbalah. Yeah. Kabbalah. Unveiled. Kabbalah. Ka ka Kabbalah. Cake. I think. Didn't somebody Stewart, do a song about that? Cape of Kabbalah. Da -da 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 -bala. <laughs> Bum bum ba da da. Oh no, that was the Coca Cabana. That's right. They had cocoa at the, the Coca. Coca Cabana. Okay. Um, so <laughs> let's carry on with our Moving mystic journey. On. Here is one of the places that you particularly wanted to see, isn't it? Well, the, oh, across the road. Only because it's the only place I'd recognise. Oh right. But it's the <laughs> George it's the one, it's the and the Pilgrim Hotel. I mean, it's a it's a magnificent building, isn't it? It's a very so ancient looking building. It was once called the George, and then and it was also once called the Pilgrim, but they've decided to m amalgamate the history. And call it both. Amalgamate the history, what? As in change well, the history? No, or? no. Um, commemorate it. Oh amal yeah. Oh look, it's this is the alley I was looking out for. I didn't realise it was. Right here. Right here. Well, this is, I suppose, this is what our first investigation is. Shall we go down there? Yes. Out on one side and crow the other. Oh. Hello. Sorry, I wasn't looking at the lady's body. That's all right. It's a stone, a, a painting of a lady. Yes. But still. <laughs> Not a real person's bottom. Um, so anyway, so we're in this. This is um, what oh, was this? Take a look at this. <laughs> oh, it's very, a very face, Glastonbury, isn't a it? faceless. Or the, the uh, whatever image it is, of. elk, is it, or something? What? Some, some the well, woman. It's a Jewess, isn't it? Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't know. Another. <laughs> and who's this? Is this Saint Bride and her dog? I have no idea. The wise, oh, the, the wise woman of Wookie Hole. By Philippa Bowers, oh, okay. Well, we've come really from Wookie Hole now, or close to it, because that's where um, that's nice. where our B and B is. Somebody's been giving her pennies. Look, little offerings. Oh yeah, pennies from heaven. So, what's in this shop here? Then this is a shop full of 
knick-knack paddy whacks, give the dog a bone. We wouldn't go in the shops unless we ask first. How cute is this thing? <laughs> to promote the practical use of crystals and gemstones for healing and trans... Oh, this is a shop, is it? Look at this. It's the green man. Ah, the green man. And the place for the candle. That's awesome. It's, it's all these little energies. Mm. The gemstones. Semi precious. Particular stones. That looks, is that a Buddha? It does oh, look yeah. like a Buddha, doesn't it? Or a stone fashioned to look like him. Angel. So it's, it's quite, quite a mix, isn't it? It's great. But I do love um, all these things. The crystals. Yeah, all the crystals. Yeah. And the colours of the crystals. It's lovely. Here we go, look at this dragon. I know you like your dragons. Yeah. It's very Chinesey. But actually it looks more like Mushu. Like who? Mushu from Disney. <laughs> anyway, never mind. Get us city. Yeah. We come to Glastonbury and you're talking about Disney. Hey look. It's a little uh, statue of Pan? Yeah. Full. Cafe. That's the Bridget Healing Centre ahead. If you need healing. Fantastic. I guess if you, you know, if your heels come off your shoes, <laughs> you uh, probably need to have them healed, don't you? <laughs> Normally I'd go to a cobbler, but... Should we carry on up the high street, see what's uh, going on? Letter, so more, um, more books on our left, right even. Of course, all mystical books. And then... Blue note to count them. Should we cross over and have a look at um, the speaking tree? Which looks an interesting shop. Fragrant Earth. I guess that's. Um, oh, wait a minute. This one out. Yeah. yeah the speaking, speaking tree. Yeah, yeah, I just said huh? that. Oh, did you? Yeah. <laughs> you phased for a moment. Oh, look, how to draw and paint fairies. Oh. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. Faces of the Soul. Tourist Information and Museum Centre. Oops, sorry. Is this place there? I don't tribunal. know, but that looks... Um, this is a tribunal. What's a tribunal in this at home? Oh, this fine late 15th century townhouse shelters dramatic finds from the Lake, Village ex Lake Villages exhibitions in the excavations. 19th... Excavations. Excavations, even. Uh, its name is due to being mistakenly identified with Glastonbury Abbey's tr Tribunal. I wonder what a tribunal is then. Well, it's a corpse, isn't it? Oh, so, oh yes, I suppose yes. A as a bit of a sceptic, to me it sort of is quite... Um, it's kind of a bit theme parky. You know, they're sort of independent people who've set up shops, basically, t t to uh, cater for the... Um, Visitors. Goddess and the Green Man, that's the one I want to go in. Okay. So more more of these shops and, and there is a co-op and there's a cancer research. I mean there's some sort of ordinary shops up this. And then on this side you've got um, is that the John the Baptist Church? Yeah. Which looks very nice. Street Enlightenment. Get real. Natural Earthling. Coffee Zero. <laughs> Covenstead's Curious Cottage. Ah, yeah, for the strange and beautiful people. Oh, yeah, so it says. Yeah. Well, that's you, isn't it? Well, that's you and me. Yeah, I'm strange and you're beautiful. Or is it the other way around? <laughs> Maybe I'm the beautiful one. Who knows? Uh, and then, uh, yeah, well, it, it's, it's quite a long high street. I mean, I'm interested in the architecture as much as the shops. God's Gift Emporium. Lots of um, tie-dye type, type. Well, it's not tie-dye, but that sort of hippie-ish stuff, isn't it? Mm -hmm. well, how would you describe it? Hippie-ish. Okay, <laughs> there we are. Good. So, Julia. So, Richard. First impression, then. I mean, we've, we've only been here five minutes, really, and we just walked up the high street, as you've witnessed. But what's, um, what's your impression? Is it's it rather cool, isn't it? <laughs> well, Lots of place to go and investigate, isn't it? Absolutely. Yeah. 
It's the first time I've had a proper walk around. Okay. Here, so. Well, I suggest. I don't know where to look. There's like, oh, that, there's that, there's that. Ah! This is clearly going to go off on one. I suggest that um, we stop the filming. We give you time to go and have a look around, um, get excited. But also, there's a cafe over there. Should we see if we can get something to eat first? Yeah. And then. So that's what we're going to do. So that was just a quick look at the high street. I know it's a bit raw and it's a bit ever ready, but um, you know, it's all new, isn't it? Hi. And you're very excited. Yes. And very excitable. So we're going to go and eat. So join us again when we try and cobble something a little more coherent in our videos. Till then. Ciao for now. Ciao for now. I'm going to cross here at the Pelican Crossing and hope Good that thing. they stop. Mm -hmm.